Let's have a look, shall we? I'm really nervous. <laughs> oh man, I really don't want this game to end. Nothing I'm missing over here, is there? Nope. But the way they're hyping it up, it sounds like this might actually be the end. Why, yes, I will get in my armor. Hello, June. Gwen is waiting just ahead. Please take care of my beloved. Oh boy. Well, yep, this is very final final scene-ish. <laughs> the fact we're getting a awesome looking thing like that. Is this the door to the realm of the Vayan? It is indeed. You've reached your destination. Gwen, Killian. This is where the reign of the Vayan ends. When this door opens, we can reach the Vayan. But in return, they too can reach us. With their divine power, they have the advantage and can kill you humans before you could even blink. Us humans? Who are you, Gwen? Have you forgotten already, Master Bart? You were never an ordinary student. I have been so many things in my long life, but you are right. I wasn't there to learn. I was there to teach. I was teaching you the role of my successor without you noticing, Glenn. Slowly but surely, I adapted your ether to mine. What do you mean by that? <laughs> what do you mean by that? Our ether needs to have the same color, the same scent, for you to be able to receive my abilities. And you've been slowly receiving them for quite some time now. This is why you could witness the standstill of time. This is why you could manifest the dead souls of the Maelstrom in the form of these children. This is why you could make the White Door appear for Magnolia. And this is why you will be able to resist the power of the Vayan for a few moments to use the Grimoire. You are my successor, Glenn. Although, hang about, didn't Killian just tell us that we're not? Is, Killi is Killian about to have a fit? <laughs> yeah, he is. What? Why don't you just do it yourself if you're so powerful? Yeah, I mean, we've seen him do crazy shit. That fight against him on the way to Frederica, like, way earlier in the game, like, Chapter 2, man was just, like, toying with us. For tens of thousands of years, I roamed the world, long before the Harbinger even existed, long before humanity existed. I am at the end of my lifespan. I can only use a fraction of the power within me. I am no longer an obstacle to the Vayan. But you... What are you talking about, Master? You said Glenn failed. You said I had potential. Glenn stands before me, stronger than ever. You were just a replacement that happened to fit, because you spent a lot of time with him. What are you trying to say? Look at you. You don't have nearly what it takes to control my power like Glenn. But... Am I supposed to live the rest of my life? Without a body? In this form? Ah, uh, what is that? Glenn! Stop it! We now complete the transfer of my power. It won't take long. I'm really worried that Killian's gonna jump in front of this. Use it to withstand the power of the Vayan and kill them with the Grimoire. Then I will be no more. Then I will be free. Free from this endless mission. Ah! Stop it! Stop it! Use my power to stand against the Vayan and kill them with the Grand Grimoire. Afterwards, you shall search for a weapon to kill the Harbinger. This will be your task going onwards. You fucking prick, Killian. What? You fool! What are you? Give it to me! 
Give me the power of the will. Killian? I can't control it anymore. I... You fucking nonce, Killian. This energy. Yes, I can feel it. I can absorb it. Stop him. Oh, okay. I didn't expect that. I did it, Glenn. You see that? I have the ultimate power. I will shatter the Vayan. I will purify the world. Unfortunately, you don't, mate, because you already put half of it into me. You know? I'm pretty sure neither of us are now strong enough to do it. You fucking nonce. He took the will by force. He wasn't prepared for it. He can't control it. What are we going to do? Get the power back. You must, you must kill him. Quickly. Gwen, he is dead. Man, so what the fuck is he? Just some being? Like, he said he existed before humanity. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what? What? Pardon? What do, what do you mean? What do you mean by that? I don't know. <laughs> I would love to have learned more. The key to the door. Give it to me. I'm sorry, Killian. I don't quite get it yet, but somehow my gut tells me I have to stop you. Stop me. You. You're nothing, Glenn. Do you, do you know who you're dealing with? Do you even know who Gwen was? I can see it in his memories. Gwen is the being who made mankind forget his existence. And now I am him. I am the one who will lead the world into a bright future. No. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go with no. The human Librodia Divinus, eighth true king, also called the Manipulator? What? 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 Gwen was one of the true kings? Gwen was one of the true kings? Impossible. The true kings wish the same as the Order, to kill the Vayan, to kill the Harbinger. They are the guardians of all the beings on Aldrea. Man, I remember reading a book about all the true kings, but I can't remember. I'm going to have to try and find that footage or some shit. I can't remember what it said about the eighth one. Or have we only been told? I can't remember. I can't even remember if we were told there was an eighth. Maybe we were only told there were seven. That might be it. It might be that we were only told there were seven and he's actually the eighth. Yeah, he can't control that shit. Ah, oh, what is this pain? Gwen, you son of a... The will is not bending. It's trying to escape me. Yeah, no shit. Like he said would happen. This seems to be our last chance. We will put you out of your pain, Killian. Oh my god, what the fuck? Holy shit. Then try it, Glenn. He's got act thrice? Oh no. Oh, this is going to be really hard. <laughs> this is going to be really hard, isn't it? He's got act thrice, so I feel like we should already be moving left. What's he weak to? Weak to fire. Well, that's like the one thing we don't have, so that's great. Oh no, we do have fire. What am I on about? Do I attack mode? I think I attack mode. And then... Defensive break, I guess. Holy shit. Oh, he's going to be doing so much damage to us. Oh, Christ.
Okay, we got a four. That's a good start. He's going to make us overheat. Shit. Hopeless strike. Oh my god! Bro. That's insane. There's no point resing him right before Killian takes a turn, is there? Because it'll just kill him again. Holy shit. Now he's on defensive tactics. I see. Okay. Bruh. Gotta take the opportunity. Wait, oh god, it's not fire anymore? Oh, come on, man. I didn't realize his fucking strengths and weaknesses changed. God damn it. Well, we're fucked now. We are completely and utterly fucked now. Yeah. Nothing we can do about this at this point. What's he weak to now? Earth? My only chance would be this and then heal with Victor. But he heals himself so hard. And everyone's out of fucking TP as well. This is crazy, man. This is going to be the hardest fight in the game, and it's not even the final fight in the game. He heals himself for so much. So I think, obviously, we've lost this. So I think what we'll have to do... We need to be we need to be in gear zero regenning our shit when he's in attack mode and doing crazy damage. And then we need to be in attack mode when he's in defense mode, I think. Because if we're in attack mode at the same time he's in attack mode, then we just get absolutely giga fucked, right? Show us how you really feel. I feel like he's probably at full health again by now. And we're obviously, we're completely fucked because we're stuck in the right-hand side of the bar now. There's no way of moving far enough left. Fucking paralyzed. He's paralyzed, poisoned, and blind. Brilliant. Oh, 
Oh, she's dead. <laughs> or he's dead. <laughs> yeah, okay. Whatever. Let's just wrap this up. Preparing Ultima Strike. Oh, good. Is there any way we could maybe kill him before that goes off? No, because Sienna's already fucked on TP. Right. <laughs> well, this is fucking brutal. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. Why does it even give you the option to do it on foot? It's not possible to do it on foot. <laughs> uh, it also doesn't matter who I bring because it's a Sky Armor fight. So I think I have to immediately start working back left. He goes offense. I need to move left as fast as possible and go immediately into gear zero. Also going to offensive break him. I guess I swap here and defend for you. Then Sienna, I'm going to do another Hornet dance and move further that way. Okay, that's fine. I do want to get Yusa out of the fire shot. I should also repair all. And then Glenn. I just I'm scared of him using his fucking insta kill move right now. Do I come out? Do I start moving right? I think I come out. Continue taking advantage of the fire shot here. Sienna, I guess you can come out as well. Victor. Gonna offensive break him again. He's on the defensive, okay. Well, this, I mean, it's definitely going a lot better than it was, right? What was circulation again? Oh, yeah. Really, just the one? That sucks. Now he's weak to earth. Victor now needs to go gear zero. needs to go gear zero. Victor, you're staying gear zero. Oh, 
Okay, now they're preparing Ultima Strike. Okay, so... We gotta fucking go, I think. Wait, no, no, that's not what I should have done. Oh god, I'm an idiot. No, I'm supposed to go into Gear Zero and survive that. Shit. Well, I fucked Bethraz there. Man, that's unfortunate. I was thinking I have to kill him before it happens, but no, I have to just survive it. You stay defending. Defend. And then Bethraz dies. Oh, Bethraz didn't die. Oh, hallelujah. Okay. Okay, Sienna, I'm going to have you defend again. Regen that TP. Uh, Victor, you are good. You come out, you repair all. This is going a lot better than last time. I don't want to jinx anything, but it's going significantly better. Hmm. I might just defend with him because I really don't want to go into overheat. Okay, you need to get zero. Oh, that is going to take us into overheat, unfortunately. That's bad. That heal costs so much in overheat. Oof. Nope. Almost didn't change gears. That would have been terrible. Now he's back to offensive. Shit. That's bad. That's really bad. Hmm. Gear one, but defend, I think. Well, he's not healing anymore, so that's something. We need to move the buff as far left as possible before we have to get out of here. Man, only Sienna needs the heal, really, but I think it's got to be done. Yeah, it did have to be done. Oh, it definitely had to be done, Jesus. Is it still... Is it fire again? It's the fire weakness. Back to defensive, okay. Shit, Sienna. Gotta go. Uh, we are worryingly far along the bar to not be able to move it left. We are. This is gonna be bad. Got a bad feeling about how far this bar is about to move to the right. I hate how much he's healing. Oh my god, he just healed 10,000. He just healed 10,000 and there's nothing we can do about it. Like, I only deal 4,000. Gotta keep regening that TP. He's about to heal, like, his entire health bar. <laughs> like, everything we've just done to him. And we're also about to hit overheat and not be able to get out of it. This is a really terrible situation. Uh, I need to just defend, just to desperately move the bar back. Like, he's regenning so much health. This is awful. Out of here and defend. Got to gear two it up, start moving back again. He regens so much health. Oh, it's actually painful. It's so painful.
Jesus Christ, dude. Got to do this, but it moves the bar right. But it does have to be done. I, I don't. I genuinely don't see how it's possible to beat this right now. Like even with everything going so well, we still didn't do it, and now we're getting fucked again. Now we're in the we're stuck in the right hand side of the overheat bar and we we can't get out of it because it costs so much TP to use skills in gear two, so we don't have enough goes of it to get us far left in the middle before we have to defend and then he kicks us back to the right. It's kind of an impossible situation right now. kicks us straight back into it and heals any and all damage we did and now Glenn's already out of TP because all, all, he had to use it all in overheat oh it's awful I, I, I'm pretty sure there's no way to win at this point I'm pretty sure he will heal more than we deal damage every time We can't again. Regen the TP, that's all there is to it. Victor's probably fucking dead. Love that he was in gear zero and defending and had a defense buff and still got killed in one shot. That's that's good. I really hate that I can't see his health bar, so I have absolutely no idea like if he's even lost any health since the start of this fight. Sienna gets to go before he does that. Hmm. Well, back into... Well, no. Hornet dance. And then you go gear zero. Defend. You go gear zero. Defend. One round left. You go gear zero. Defend.
Ugh. This sucks so hard, man. I do not see how it's possible to beat this fight. There has to be some way, but I'm not seeing it. Anything we do to him, he just immediately heals. He can deal far more damage, and he doesn't have to deal with the overdrive bar, which completely wrecks us. Just doing all I can to move it back right now. This is the furthest back on the bar we've been in a long time. Oh my god, did we do it? Holy fuck. Holy fuck, we actually did it? Oh my goodness, that was so hard. I really didn't think we had a chance. I did I was I was strongly considering throughout like the last few minutes just like resetting the fight because I didn't think we had a chance in that one. Oh man. Oh man. No. The power is mine. I'm not giving it away. The world is going down the drain. Only I can save it. Wrong. Wrong. Whoa. What is this place? A place where you can't depend on your mechanical means. Stop it, Killian. You don't have control over the power. I'm going to plow this world from the ground up, Glenn. You cannot stop me. What the fuck is happening right now? Feel my true power. Oh my god, what is this? Oh my god, what is this? There's a phase two of this fight. Oh my god. I can't believe there's a phase two of this fight. <laughs> this looks insane. I assume if we die now, we start here, right? What if I have to, like, quit? <laughs> what if I have to quit? Do we get to start here? Surely. Okay, who who are the targets here? We've got the tank, we've got the healer, we got the... I actually, oh, Alfred? Wait, what? And the magician. Tank, healer, magician, and Alfred. Where? Okay. Uh, what is this music? This is crazy. Um, I don't. I don't even know where to begin. I guess we blade reflection and just see what happens. I think Glenn is probably a Glenn alt angle. Maybe it's a let her do her thing until... Because Sienna's skills cost so much. One thousand five hundred. That's a pretty good opening. I'm thinking we do this. <laughs> That's weird that the main body of the creature disappears. <laughs> Okay. Right. Uh, we're going to buff ourselves. And then they're all weak to light, right? So we need to swap our boy out. Wait, he's got the dark spear now, doesn't he? Oh, no, he's got light sword as well. That's okay. He's, he can do it. Okay, okay. We need to kill the healer. Utmost importance is killing the healer. I think we just start spinning kicking now, right? Uh, 
If I feel like it's skipping. Is it, it feels like it's skipping some of the animations. I don't know. That was strange. I don't know if I'm imagining that. Um. Sure, let's do... Actually, no, we do need a heal. Let's do this. Could this be the final fight of the game? Like, this is so epic. <laughs> but, like, there's still the Vayan to deal with, there's still Marcus to deal with, there's still the Harbinger to deal with, but the way they're, like, it's a two-phase fight, first with Sky Armors and then with people, and, like, it's against Killian, who is with the group to begin with, and has been, like, a thorn in our side the entire game, and, like, the setting of it all, and, like, it feels like it's hype enough that it could be the final fight of the game, but I just don't understand story-wise how it could be, you know? Wait, did he... Did he not go? Wait, what just happened? Why did he just die? Wait, what? I just totally missed that. I, don't know, I guess someone put a spell on him. I guess he had deadly fucking stagger or something. I did I did not notice that ever get put on him. <laughs> well, shit. I think it's a restrain moment. And then I guess it's a res moment. Although, can we survive? We can probably survive this, right? Have I hit a button or something that makes it auto-advance? The text was auto-advancing before the fight, but I thought that was just like because of the epicness of the moment or something. But I'm worried I've actually hit something and it's skipping stuff. <laughs> hmm. I think we got to restrain. I'm really worried that he's going to kill someone with the, the tank that's going to kill someone. But... Oh my god, literally 1 HP? Jesus Christ. <laughs> 1 HP to full HP. She's insane. She's she's actually insane. Yes, we got the healer. Okay. Uh, we're going to cross slash... I think the Magician is next most important. Obviously, Healer has to go out first. Everyone knows that. Heal all for free. I really want to res... Hmm, it's a long time before she gets to go again is the issue. I really want to res, but... I guess I should res on someone else's turn and then heal her up when I can. Oh, death stagger. I just saw it. Wait, what? She just died? Oh, fuck. Well, now we're done, aren't we? Shit. Pretty sure we're done. I don't think she's going to survive. Wait, she got brought to one. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, but <laughs> there's no way. Uh, that's TP, not a, not a heal. We could give her a meal. Okay, there's actually... 
kind of works. Mika, Angel Wing, Bathraz. And then heal all. And we're back in. We're back in the game. Also, I've just noticed we have another uh, ultra move we can use. So let's do that right now. I am quite worried about the TP situation. The TP situation is looking grim. Now, she used an item. Does that count as breaking the consecutive use? Or do you have to use a different skill to break the consecutive use? Oh no, that's still, that's still over a thousand. That's a lot. Unless that's just because of... That might just be because of... Uh, what do you want to call it? Okay, magician's done. Magician is done. Holy shit, that was like a thousand. Oh god, Alfred uses that twice. That's not good. Shit, Mika is now a little fucked. We do need to heal, but I also think we really... Mm. I think we swap to Victor right now. And I think we do grant TP. I think that's what has to be done right now. We're really low. Uh, and then we just keep going for it, I guess. It's a long time before we can hit another heal. So maybe I lend energy, actually, to Mika to move the bar further back, because otherwise we were going to be stuck in overheat. Hmm. I think it's a restrain moment again. Restrain is so useful. It's actually kind of crazy how good Restrain is. And then, is it a healing him moment? I think it's a healing him moment. I like that. They don't do enough damage to... Oh god, maybe they do do enough damage? Oh wow, okay. <laughs> I was about to say they don't do enough damage to kill me before... Wait, who was it died? It was Glenn that died. Okay. Hmm. Tank's gotta go. If I do it again, we do go into overheat, but I think it's actually worth. Oh, we actually got him. Nice. Okay. Oh, God. No, that wasn't worth at all. Oh, no. Raise Bethraz because he's got the light thing. <sighs> Fuck me. Okay. Now I hate to break the thing, but it's probably worth putting a bleed on him now. I do hate to break our um, streak. Okay, now we... I really want to heal all. I really want to raise Glenn as well. Oh god, there's a lot of things I want to do. I'd love to find a slot to put in a Krez Transform as well, but it's not, it's not happening. <laughs> okay, we're going to shield 
And then I think it's time for you to swap out. And we do the old agility up. And then we do calm water. She evaded it. Nice. She evaded it again. Very nice. Love that. Love that for us. Oh, God. Oh, no. I just noticed who died. Oh, God. Matter of urgency, Resimalia. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. And then Matter of Urgency res Glenn as well. And then Amalia gets to do the healed all, heal, 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 heal all, and thank fuck that the overdrive bar is in, in favor of that happening. And then Sienna. It's time to go big dick, I guess. This costs 20, man, even with that. She only gets a few goes with it. Now we're just hitting the shit out of him. Uh, we could restrain. I'm also thinking... Okay, we'll restrain now. Because it's also the thing that moves it backwards on the bar. So that was like super worth it. And then next Glen turn, we're ultra moving again, I think. Uh... Okay, then we keep light sorting it up. Uh, don't think any of that helps us super. Actually, we still. The agility buff had worn off. Okay. Uh. I'm going to swap to him, and we're going to do the TP thing. Now, unfortunately, that does actually take us out of overdrive, which wasn't my intention. So I can't actually use the alt, because that will take us way out of overdrive now. <laughs> nice crit. Man, I wonder how much health he has. I have really no clue. I guess I'm swapping to you. I wonder if this... I actually have no idea if his attacks count as magic or not. I guess... maybe? I don't know. Um, right, now we keep on moving this way. You are fully out of TP. You have some TP left. Hmm, but you've got so much agility and stuff. I really... I think I'm going to just give you sweets. Actually, I'm going to give you... Nectar. Like, if this... <laughs> we're right at the end of the game. I should use my fucking highest shit. What am I doing saving it? There's no reason to save it. <laughs> oh my god, did I use it on the wrong person? I used it on the wrong person, didn't I? Fuck me, what am I doing? And then I didn't even use... Oh my god, I didn't even use the big one. I used sweets that time. Oh my god, I can't... Huge brain fart. Imagine if I lose now because I fuck this up. Okay, we do need a heal. Holy shit, he's dealing giga damage right now.
Oh my god, did we get him? Holy shit, we got him. Holy shit, I was so worried. I was so worried because of how much damage he was dealing that we wouldn't be able to survive another one. Knock it off, Killian. That's enough. I shall master the will. Tell me the key phrase. The key to this door. As if we're going to tell you. I can't properly read your minds yet. But when you all thought of the key phrase at the same time, it was understandable even to me in my current state. Oh, fuck me. I am powerful enough to defeat the Vayant. Bitch, you literally just couldn't beat us. You weren't powerful enough to beat us, and you think you can beat the Vayan? Be witness to it. Defying the Lord of the Underworld, the gates shall open. Killian, you mustn't. Don't worry. I'll protect you from the power of the Vayan. Foolish child. Foolish, weak child. All right, yeah, I'm not doing that voice anymore. The Grimoire and its bearer need to be destroyed. But if you won't get out of our way, we may as well take over your body. Ah, oh, what are you doing? Weakened like this, we shall do the impossible. We shall become one with a true king. This doesn't look good. Quickly, everyone, to me. This is the Grimoire's chance. Ah. Oh. Holy mother of God. We are becoming one with him. We shall make him our new champion. Now everybody, I'm going to burst the Grand Grimoire. How dare you! Ah. Jesus Christ! Did we did we do it? Did we do it good? <laughs> did, did did we actually manage it? Are are the Vayan dead? Holy shit, and the Grand Grimoire fucking shattered and didn't reform. The Grand Grimoire. It has no ether to absorb and is crumbling to dust. But if it can't find any ether, does that mean the Vayan is still alive? It hurts. I was about to say, like, didn't, wouldn't they have released ether when they died? Our power is drained. Looks like it's not over. Oh my god, what is this? We are still powerful enough to crush you like flies. After all, you are nothing but mere humans. Mere humans? Again and again you destroy the world. But again and again humanity and nature rebuild. They never give in. Their will to live is never broken. You call them weak, but in truth, you fear them. For the people fight beyond the limits of their own lives. He's right. You were alive when the Harbinger came, and will still be so when he returns. All that you do, you do for yourselves. But look at the short lives of us humans. For countless generations, people have worked tire tirelessly towards a goal that they would never see in their lifetimes. They fought against a problem that would not affect them or their children. They gave their entire lives to a cause that was far in the future. They fought for later generations, despite setbacks, despite uncertainty. That is the strength of humanity. That is your downfall. 
Ah. Oh shit, Killian is still in there? Oh man, okay. Glenn, I am trying to stop them. Killian, you won't be able to defeat them alone, but I can weaken them. They are taking control again. Prepare yourselves. With weapons of steel against the gods, I guess we will make it work. This thing looks anything but godly to me. We should succeed then, right? If we don't try it, we will never knowingly know. This world has so much to offer. You will not destroy it. Let's punch some sense into these gods. With these fiends in our way, we have no chance to lead Aldrea into a better future. Then let's show them what we've learned on our journey. You are right. She she she. This may be our last battle together. We can do it, everyone. I believe in us. Let's win it then. Holy fuck, look at that. Oh my god, that's fucking incredible. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow, that is gorgeous. That background, that fucking monster design. Fuck me. Oh man. Okay, first things first. Are there multiple targets? No, it is just the Vayan. It is just the Vayan. Oh man, where to even begin? I guess with the old faithful opener. Then we all break. Holy shit. What the fuck? Its opening move is to reduce our entire team to 1 HP? Ah! Oh my goodness. So it's weak to, um, it's weak to dark, right? So I should bring out the Thraz. Okay, well, it's a heal all moment, that's for fucking sure, Jesus Christ. Uh, then we're gonna bleed it. And then we're gonna, I guess, cross slash it. We're still too early in the bar to go backwards with that, so... Holy fuck, man. Okay, now it might be time to swap back to her. And we do a bit of Drunken Master. Cheeky Dark Spear. Okay, we got a shield, everyone. Seems good to me. Raise everyone's crit chance. Okay, it's going well. It's going pretty well. Interruption? Ah, oh. ah, oh. Killian. Vayan uses duplicate. No. And that one's got a magic and physical resist. Oh no, this is this is all kinds of terrible. So I can't do anything to that one. So I just have to start attacking this one now. But if they've got two of them, that's going to completely fucking ruin us. 
This is going to be insane. Oh, my goodness. Uh, well, we obviously need to heal all. That's not optional. Okay. Uh, fuck me. All right. Well, we'll all break this one now. Oh, this one is only a tiny amount of health. I see. I see. Okay, that makes me feel better. <laughs> oh, this one will die. Well, that one's got physical magical resist, so I don't think it actually matters if I... Whatever, this one's dead. That one's not dead? Oh, no, it is dead. Okay, fuck me. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> How? Nah, it dead. It dead. Dark Spear that bitch. Okay, I think now we actually swap. And whilst everyone's still fairly healed up, we apply the TP. Uh, and then we attack stance. Okay. Uh... Petal Storm, I guess. Nirvana, alright. Shit, we're in overheat. Okay. Uh. Just gonna defend to get out of that. Is it Ultra Move time? I think it's Ultra Move time. Let's ultra move him. We move the bar back. It fucks him up. What a crazy final fight, man. This is nuts. I am wondering, though, what's going to happen with Marcas and the church and everything? Did you just drain everyone's TP? Let me help you. Holy shit, and he's refilling everyone's TP. Oh, man, that's cool. You're getting fought against from the inside. Too many summons. Ah, I should I should use his big thing, but I keep forgetting about it. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Keep forgetting about it. Uh, okay, we're going to buff everyone. No. Oh, my God. I thought he was going to kill him. Okay, okay. Right, now, let's Drunken Master again. Uh, let's, I guess we're back to Cross Slashing. Huge damage. Uh oh, he's using Act Twice again. Oh wait, no, sorry, Act Twice is a different one. He's, he's using an interruption again, but it gave him a different thing. Last time it was spawn a second copy. Now he can act twice. That's really bad for us, actually. That is really bad for us. <laughs> Not much we can do about it, however. We just keep hitting. Just keep hitting. Just keep hitting. See, I really want to use the summoned attack, but it's this moves us back on the bar, so this is just what we need to do right now. Vayan uses End of the World. Pardon me? No. You won't harm them. Nothing happened? Man, Killian is fighting to save us right now. Jesus Christ. Okay, we need some big fucking heals. Let's get our friend back in here with a heal all. And do it again. Jesus Christ, you really hate him, huh? Two thousand eight hundred, huge. Got to do this. Move it back. It has to be done. Uh, how's your TP situation? It's all right. Uh. Okay, now this doesn't move us back, so now I think we do... Actually, you know what? It might be worth saving it to give us a amount of ether. Ether, TP. 
That actually, it might be worth saving it to do that. So you know what? We will. Oh, he's dead. Shit. I didn't realize that he doesn't get to go before Amalia did. Well, Amalia can res him to full health, and no one else is super low, so it's actually kind of fine. Uh, I'm just going to defend this turn. I don't want to go into overdrive. Keep defending. It is very unfortunate that it changed off of the heel right as that happened, but... I think we defend again. Barrier switch? What does that mean? Magic resist for two turns. Okay, that's fine. Uh, do we up everyone's agility again? I think that's a good idea. Is now the time to restore 60 to everyone? It would cap Glenn, but I think it's good for... Well, it would cap a couple of people. I think it's worth it, though. It moves the bar back as well. Wait, am I going crazy or did it not happen? I just watched their TP not go up. Did I do something wrong? I may have misread, maybe? I don't know. I'm confused why that didn't happen. Hmm. Okay, well, I will have to look at that in a sec <laughs> when it gets back to Bathraz. I don't understand why that didn't give us all a shitload of stuff. And again... Did I swap him out or something? I used it. Didn't we have full? I thought we had full summons. I don't know. I'm confused. Whatever. Uh, it's got to be the heal all, hasn't it? And then we do this. And then it's ultra move time. Let's fully break him again. Interruption. He duplicates. Okay. Is he duplicating broken? Oh my. Wait, what? Okay, Killian, you've got a... Vayan uses you shall be as gods. I'm not going down without doing anything. Killian uses Sword Wave. Oh my goodness. This is so sick, man. This is unbelievably fucking cool. Actually insane. Heal all my TP. Yeah, not Bethraz's. Fucking mine. Jesus Christ, that was a mistake I made last time. We gotta use this shit like candy right now. Dark Spear. He's like, attack buff, magic buff, defense buff, mind buff, but then at the same time, attack break, magic break. Uh, so I guess the net result is that there's not much uh, happening. <laughs> okay, I've got a shield, right? I don't know if we need a shield right now. I'm going to do this. I think we're okay. Interruption. Vayne uses end of the world again. Killian, can you stop it again? 
Oh god, what's happening? Killian's got to resurrect us all? No. You shall live, called it. I, I had a moment. I, that was clearly like a fake you out moment. I had a moment as the fucking death screen music started playing of like, wait, was that not supposed to happen? <laughs> but then they brought up the text box quickly enough that it didn't. I didn't actually get to say it. <laughs> but I was about, I was on the verge of saying, wait, was I wrong? Did, was that not supposed to happen? <laughs> you shall live. We're, we're still in it. The fight continues. Is he full healing us? He's giving us a full heal. I can't do any more than this. Now, you need to defeat the Vayan on your own. That's it. That's his last gasp. He gave us a full heal. We're going to make the best use of it we can, mate. Appreciate your efforts. Appreciate your efforts, lad. Alright. Uh... I'm thinking we lend energy to Amalia. Then it's back to Dark Spearing. Uh, and then we can hit up a... Do you think... I think we hit up a Krez Transform, actually. You shall be as gods. Oh, fuck. He extended all his buffs. Oh, that's really bad. That's really bad. Okay, we need to move the bar back. Need to keep moving the bar back. Shit. Wait, he's going again. Oh, no. Wait, he's going again before any of us are. Uh, not before any of us. Oh, before Amalia is. Uh, crap. Okay. In that case, it's time to have a meal, Sienna. And it's time to have a meal, uh, Bethraz. Glenn might die here. Oh my god. Holy shit. This is all kinds of bad, huh? Defend to get out of that. Uh, it's got to be a heal all. We don't have anything that can deal with that. That's very unfortunate. It's got to be a defend moment then. And then it's got to be a second defend moment, I think. Actually, it's a it's a utility overdrive moment. Oh, this is terrible! Oh no! Holy shit! How do we beat that? Oh, we swap to Len. And we take off his buffs, don't we? That's what we do. I forgot I had that ability. Oof. That is unfortunate. I think we're done. I don't think we can actually... I don't think we can actually beat it now, unfortunately. Oh, man, that would have been so cool. That would have been so cool if we could have beaten it in this part and done the whole thing. But if we fail here, which I think we're about to, we are going to have to end the part. I can't see a way. We need to res, like, Sienna. We've got a bunch of cures. Is there anything else that I can use? No. Okay, so we do this. But we're in overheat, so, like, he's just going to instantly annihilate us again, you know? 
I meant to res Sienna, god damn it. Press block, huge. Oh, fuck me. Oh, we've got an ultra. We just need Amalia to survive and we can ultra everyone back. We just need Amalia to su survive, but that's a huge ask. <laughs> Malia, please survive. Barrier switch. Krez blocking. Oh my god, Krez, you absolute hero. Oh my god, I almost used Glens. I almost accidentally used Glens. That would have been terrible. We all break. And then we do the res and full heal for everyone. I wish it did TP as well, but that would probably be too powerful. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. We're still in it. We're still in it. We are still in it somehow. This is incredibly difficult, this final bit. This has to be the final phase, right? Must be. Must be. Okay. Nothing I do can get past that, I think. This is a nectar moment for Glenn. Enjoy, Glenn. Okay, honestly, Nirvana is so much better than the actual punching one. Now it's a magic overdrive moment. We've got to move this fucking bar back. We have to move this fucking bar back. I don't know if that's worth it. Uh, actually, no. We need to swap back to you now. Three weapons summoned. Okay, let's give everyone... Okay, let me, let me, let's read this, right? Restores TP by an amount based on the number of summons times 20, right? We have three weapons summoned, so that's 60 TP to everyone, right? This should be what happens. Let's watch the TP bars. It didn't happen. What am I getting wrong with that? Oh, wait, no, did it happen? Am I blind? Uh, did I look away right as it happened? Maybe it happens later than I thought and I looked away too soon. I don't know. Maybe I'm actually fucking blind. It's certainly very possible. Uh, oh, he's still really broken. Okay. I'm going to attack stance. Now we can actually start fucking hitting him again. Let's raise everyone's agility. Let's do a heal all. Krez blocked. Krez is coming in clutch here, man. Okay. Uh, Dark Spear, yeah? Yep. Really need... Oh my god, we did it! Oh my god, we did it! It is done! It is done! Holy fuck, what a fight. What an ending. Oh my god, and to think that I thought we were completely fucked halfway through that. Well, not halfway, like three quarters through that. In the final phase, after Killian had done a full party res. And then we still, like, had two of our team down. And then Amalia came through with the clutch. Oh my god. That is one of the best fights I have ever played, I think. That was actually fantastic. Ah. We are dying. Holy shit, man. That was unbelievably good. What a great character Killian is. Like, terrible, terrible person. 
fucked us over, did all kinds of shit, awful person, great character. And the fact that he starts in your party and he's like your best friend for the first bit of the game and then fucking betrays you and then like all the way to the end he's there. Man, what a fucking story. What a great story. Well done, Glenn. The failure is mine. But luckily you were here, as always. I'm back in control and the weakened Vayan are locked inside me. You guys did a great job. Where I failed, you have triumphed. But I don't want to leave this world completely useless. Killian! The Vayan die with me. It's happening just like Gwen wanted. But... Oh shit, now the power goes to him. The power returns to you. Gwen's chosen one. Live. Well. Goodbye, Killian. Forgive me. Forgive me. Sister. Is everyone alright? Is it possible? Have we won? Oh man, we've won against the Vayan. <laughs> that still leaves Marcus and the church and the Harbinger though. Is that actually something that's going to happen in this game? Or is that going to be like, see you in Chain Echoes 2 kind of thing? Because that, like, that has to be the final fight, right? There is no shot that that's not the final fight. That was too epic. That was too incredible. So I don't, I, I can't imagine we also now have to go and deal with Marcus and everything else. Glenn? The will is mine now. So to answer your question. Yes, we've won. I can't believe it. The Vayan are defeated? The cycle is broken and the Grand Grimoire destroyed forever. Finally. I mean, great job. We did the impossible. She, she, she. All the fighting has an end at last. It was such a long journey. Thank you, everyone. What's that? What, what's the rumbling? What is happening? The door crumbles. Wait, no, that's not Glenn. <laughs> Sienna. The door crumbles. And with it, Nisa's significance. The city is no longer needed. It will fall apart. Then we'd better escape. Fucking book it. Oh, June's, June's just lying there. Did June die at the same moment that Gwen did? Huh. Do you hear that? Is that the Himmelskaiser? Oh, God. Is... <laughs> I forgot. I completely forgot that uh, I was like, yeah, there's no way they made that model and they're not using it. But it's okay. He's actually going to help us out, right? He's going to recognize me as one of the true kings and he's going to give us a fucking lift. Asnad Asnadil. Not even a true king can sleep with all this noise. We survived the Vayan and now we are supposed to fail against a true king? Not if I can help it. Asnadil, away with you. Now give us a lift, mate. Or, or that. You two seem to get along well. I forced my will on him. Glenn. It's alright. The power is still quite new. Besides, it's not so easy to impose one's will on a true king. Ah. Oh god, he fainted? Okay. Is everyone else going to be able to drag him out? <laughs> Glenn. My god, what an incredible fucking ending that was. When the fiery calamity that hovered over Volandis suddenly disappeared, the people burst into shouts of joy. They did not know what had happened yet, but they felt that they were finally free. Celebrations were held all throughout the country. Princess Celestia Valkyria of Tarin was unanimously elected as queen of a new Volandis. She was advised by a council represented from all corners of the land. The tyranny had ended. 
but the unification between the people still had a long way to go. The disagreements between the countries did not magically disappear. A history of war could not be erased that easily. So the Queen and her council stood before an enormous task. But they had hope, and therefore they knew they would succeed in the end. The Red Succubus? Oh, she did make it out. Nice. You? Seriously? It's true. People think of her as some kind of elegant femme fatale. <laughs> I can't help it. I didn't pick the name. <laughs> oh, hush. It's not that funny. And what do you intend to do now, Sir Eagle? I will travel throughout Eldrea. The world is vast, and there is still much I have not discovered from my first journey. What about you? You will probably return with Len. Take me with you. What? Please, make me your squire. Are you seriously serious? Yes. I want to see more of the world, and I want to help the people. I thought with all the nasty stuff I did back then that there was no saving me. But Glenn showed me otherwise. I can still change. Please let me be your squire, and help me make the world a better place. My dear Rob, I would lovingly love to. I... I can't take another sip. What are you saying? Only a newborn can, can get drunk on this piss water. Let's head back to your home city of Arcadia and drink some proper wine. I could use a vacation, true, now that my task is done. Get ready, everyone. She's coming. Are we going to get some, like, post credit scene about Marcus or something? It's, I mean, it's clearly being left for another game at this point, but... Happy birthday, Amalia. You, you are all too much. This is not necessary. But uh, thank you. Thank you so much. Bathraz sends his regards. Where is he, anyway? Probably making preparations for the Order of Leonar. The Harbinger is waiting. Bathraz, you are leaving us. We don't have much time. You don't have much time. Your life is urgent. You cannot save me. In two years, at the latest, the pact will have taken my life. My future is the price I knowingly paid to receive the curse. We will still try. You saved our lives in Reiner's tomb, and now we will save yours. Our lives are connected by this curse. We will find its roots and help you. Won't we, Rayorim? Thank you. Uh, thank you. Interesting. So he's going to try and fucking find a way to circumvent the pact. Whatever he's doing, I'm sure it is the right thing. By the way, where is Glenn? He was just here. I'll see where he is. Big chillin' on the balcony. Chad move. Enjoying the fresh air? There are a lot of people in there. You know I prefer being on my own. Besides, I haven't gotten used to this power yet. When are you leaving Volantis? Tomorrow morning. I'm boarding the first ship. Busy, aren't you? Are you going to be a second Gwaine now? No. I'll stay who I am. I've learned that Gwaine's way of doing things is not the right way. I can't just use any means without remorse to achieve my goals. Agreed. I will... Oh wait, that's her. <laughs> I will dedicate myself to vanquishing the Harbinger once order is restored in Valandis. With the power as queen... I will strengthen the Leonar order again. Now, where do you come from? 
It doesn't seem to be afraid. Oh, he's been coming here all day. I even gave him a name. Oh, what are you calling him? Glen. He had red hair like this bird's feathers and loved flying. So, you know? Seems to be my ability. After all, I sensed that Glen was not Timothy as well. Wait, what? What? I only took his face to spare you sadness. Are you angry? Is he Gwen? Did Gwen take him over? It was certainly Glenn's own decision, right? His decision, huh? So, this is what Gwen's power feels like? Kind of scary. Use it wisely. Don't make the same mistakes I did. I can see Gwen's memories. I am to defeat the Harbinger with the help of the other true kings? Now this is set up for a sequel if ever I heard it. Oh man. A truly eternal mission standing there before me. I have no doubt you will succeed. I have to go now. The Vayan inside me are dead. Now, my soul will dissolve in the Maelstrom. Did you know that I had a pet bird? What? Why are you saying this now of all times? I grew up in the slave town of Golgotha, you know that. A pile of garbage surrounded by high walls. My mother had a thing with the guards, so we were doing okay. She often got presents. At one point, she brought me a cage with a bird. He became my best friend. But on one day, bad men came to our house, and my mother sent me to the roof. Of course, I took the bird with me, and we hid up top. However, I became afraid for him. He had nowhere to go in his tiny cage, so I opened it and told him to hide somewhere else. Somehow I thought he would come back, but he flew up, higher and higher. He picked up wind and flew over the walls. As I wondered where he was going, for the first time I understood the concept of freedom. I also wanted to go where the bird flew. I also wanted to fly over every wall. That's why you became a Sky Armor pilot. People fear death and seek immortality, but after having lived so many lives, you can believe me on one thing. One life is more than enough, as long as you live it to the fullest. But I couldn't do that. I was weighed down by my burden for so long. Even when I was in a Sky Armor, I was never really free. I could never truly fly. Perhaps I really do have the most potential to handle Gwen's power. But I don't have the will to do it. I've had enough. What are you talking about? It's not too late, Killian. We'll turn it around one more time. With my power, I will save you. And you will become the new true king. What the fuck? What the fuck? He gave... Oh my god. Are you crazy? I will only fail. Look where I ended up. We humans have to make mistakes in order to grow. In the end, all that matters is the person we become. I'm tired, and, at the, and I'm at the end of my road. You, though, still have your whole journey ahead of you. Learn from your mistakes, and become the saviour of this world. Glenn. Do not cry. You are doing me a favour. I will return to the Maelstrom now. Glenn. When we die, we have the potential to become anything we wish for. A part of us can become a mammal, a fish, an insect. We can even become a part of the earth, a plant, the leaf on a tree. We can become a drop of water in the ocean, or a grain of sand on the beach. A cloud in the sky, a star in the night. But if I could wish for anything, I wish that a little piece of me would be reborn as a bird. A bird that could spread its wings through the blue sky, truly free. Holy shit, he's Killian. He's fucking Killian. Glenn is a nice name for the bird. I assume he's putting on Glenn's voice as well as his face, so I'm going to continue doing that voice, even though it's Killian. I should go now. We will meet again, if not in this life, 
than in the next. We will. Hmm? What are you doing? You want to come with me, Glenn? He's off. Oh, oh. And there he is. Quite an effort to put on a fake face. Seems like my power hasn't fully awakened yet, Glenn. Ah, your face. He saw him transform. There's the brat. Gotcha. Leave me alone. What is the problem? She's a stowaway. Nothing to bother you, sir. Help me. I'll pay for a ticket. You don't have to do that, sir. You will take the money. I will take the money. Well, he's got the mind control down, Pat. Are you all right? Yes. What is your name? June. What? What? And what are you doing here, June? I was told that there is a person on this ship that will take care of me. That's why I sneaked on here. Who is that supposed to be? The man with many faces. Who told you that? You ask a lot of questions, mister. It was the man without a face. The man with the mask. <laughs> is that so? So fate has accepted me. Well then, accompany me a little. Do you like the bird? Did you pay a ticket for it too? Of course I did. A little too big for mere luggage. Strange. A bird that can fly travels by ship. You're right. It is strange. He's only here because of me. I didn't want to be alone. But now you have me. Right. How about we say goodbye to him together? Agreed, June? Agreed. Here you go. Here you go. Farewell, my best friend. Wow, he's fast. I bet he's the fastest bird in all of Eldrea. Okay, I'm going to need some answers on that June. Like, how is June there? Does, does a June always appear to be with the true king? That's it. There's credits. Holy shit. Okay, there are unanswered questions for sure. There was definitely stuff that I thought was going to happen this game, but was instead set up for next game. However, I think they did it pretty perfectly. Also, hello, a proper singing credits? Very nice, very nice. Hang on, let me uh, turn up. Wait, no, which way is turning it up? This way is turning it up, right? Let me, I just want to turn that up a bit because it's really quiet. But, uh, very pretty. Yeah, man, that was incredible. What a game. That is, I think, like, I was thinking this the whole way through. And I was like, no, nah, I can't. I, I, I don't know. Like, something's got to go bad, right? It, this can't be this good. This can't be this good the entire way through. And then it was. And I think that means now I'm hitting credits. I think that's one of the best games I've ever played in my life. It's up there. Like, I have a few games. I have a few games that I would put in, like, best games I've ever played in my life. My, my top one, Final Fantasy XIV. Love it very much. And then, just underneath that, we've got Persona 5 Royal. We've got Red Dead Redemption 2. And I think this is joining that small group. Chained Echoes. Up there as one of the best experiences I've ever had. Lol, Sienna robbing the dude and then giving it back. <laughs> as Glenn flies above.
You go, Glenn. I can't believe Glenn let himself be killed. Man. What an incredible game. What an incredible game. I, I have basically no notes. The crystal system, here's a note, the crystal system sucks. However, I am aware that he is in the process of reworking it. He posted a uh, thing saying that he is going to do an update in May. By the time you see this video, it may in fact already be out. I'm recording this in like sort of late-ish April. Uh, so by the time this actually goes up, it's probably going to be well over a month. So uh, yeah, it's, the, the update to the crystal system is probably out by the time you see this, but obviously I haven't. I don't know what that will be because of when I'm recording it, but uh, hopefully, oh, <laughs> hopefully it makes it better. And aside from the crystal system, I guess the only other note I would have... Oh, I never... <laughs> I just realised I never spent those skills, did I? I have, like, four skill points or something that I could have spent on, like, stat buffs to make that last bit a little easier. Oh my god, Killian's going to see his sister. Oh, man. After all that, he's finally made it back to see her. Hi, sister. I became a god. Oh, Killian, man. I'm so curious about what's going on with June, though. Like, June seemed to die at the end there, but, like... It's not been long, I assume. I assume this is pretty immediately after what just happened. So it's not like she's had time to re be reborn and grow back up into a kid, and now she's joining Killian, like, all, this, all these years later. It seems like it's... She's already there, like, straight away, joining him. Man, this song is so pretty. So yeah, that's a question. What the fuck is with June? Uh, next question. Marcus and the church and the harbinger. Obviously, that's just like a see you in Chain Echoes 2 moment, I guess. I really did think that that was going to be wrapped up in this game. So in, in another game, I might knock it a point for that. But in this game, I think I won't because the way they did handle the main plot was so fucking perfect. And it feels like the right time to end. Like, that was an epic as fuck battle. And if we now... If we now had to go and deal with all that as well, I feel like it would feel too long. It would feel like it was dragging, right? So I think... Even though it did kind of seem like it was going to happen this game, I think they did kind of do it perfectly. Matthias Linda. Fucking well in, mate. Incredible. Incredible game. What a... What an incredible achievement. Seven years. Seven years of dev time. And mostly doing it solo. You've got the music done, obviously, by someone else. And there's obviously all this help from Deck 13 with all the local localization and everything and all that. But the vast majority of the work, the art, the dialogue, the coding, like all the bits and pieces that go into making up the game, he did on his own. Absolutely stunning achievement, mate. You're never going to see this probably. But if you do, <laughs> well done. Well fucking done, man. Holy shit. The end. Now is it going to fade away? Uh... <laughs> I actually, I'm pressing buttons and it's not leaving this screen? Hmm. <laughs> ah, there we go. It was just taking a while. There we go. The end. Thank you for your support. Without you, this game wouldn't exist. Ah, these are the people that backed it on, uh, backed it on the old Kickstarter. Shout out these chads. The Heavenly Beasts. I guess these were his, uh, his tiers of support. I, I didn't hear about this game until after it released, so, uh, I... Did not even know this Kickstarter existed at the time, but if he ever does another Kickstarter, you can bet your fucking ass that I will be there giving it the maximum possible support. Like, absolutely insane stuff. Like, you could... I, he'd, he'd get such a massive budget for whatever he does next. Like, this has popped off so hard. Everyone loves it. So many more people are going to know about him now and want to support his next project if he does another Kickstarter. He might have made so much money from this that he doesn't need to do another Kickstarter. Who knows? But, like... It is entirely possible that he does, and yeah, I feel like so many people are going to be there for that. 
I'll just uh, turn the music back down a bit because uh, we this isn't the new song anymore. This is we know this one. But yeah, overall, I mean, it's a clear 10 out of 10. It is a very clear 10 out of 10. It's one of the best things I've ever played. And anything that I could, like, knock it down a point for, it's just, like, everything else is so fucking good that it just doesn't deserve to even have a point knocked off for, like, a couple of minor issues. Like, at the end of the game, it does take quite a long time to get through everyone spending skill points. Like, I think the last, the last time I did a skill point session, it took, like, half an hour of menuing, which obviously is a bit long. But, you know, it wasn't that bad for most of the game. And the results are obviously very worth it, so... Yeah. Man. I guess, uh... I guess we will cut to the end of these credits now. Uh, I don't know how long... I don't know how many people actually backed it, so I don't know how long this section of the credits will go on for. Uh, Magicians of the Academy of Nisa. <laughs> it's cool, uh, cool tier names. Uh, so yeah, I guess I will just cut here to the end of the credits and uh, give some final outros. There we go. That was a really long credit. It went on for about another 10 minutes after the, uh, after the uh, point where I said I'd see you in a bit. Oh, my screen just darkened. In fact, that probably was exactly 10 minutes. <laughs> nice. Uh, you've been placed before the final boss battle. Save your game to receive a completed save file tag. Ah, back back alive again, I see there, June. <laughs> so what was our final our final time? 56 hours, 30 minutes. Incredible. Incredible. So, now, there are, of course, other things. Like, oh, there's in fact another side quest over there? Interesting. But I was thinking, like, the... We haven't found, like, five of those tablets to fight the God King in all grain and stuff. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. I, I could, I guess. Uh, but I, I feel like this was such a satisfying ending, you know? I don't know if it would be... I don't know if it would be more satisfying to continue on and do, like, side ultra boss thing. Or whether it would be more satisfying to just leave it here for now. So... I, I feel like it's a pretty good chance that this will be the end. If I do feel like doing more, then there will be a bonus part, I guess, uh, with the God King, I suppose. Although I'd need to have multiple parts to even find these things. I'd probably I'd probably walk through it at this point, I guess. But uh, yeah, I don't know. But um, I'm not. I'm definitely not promising that. I will certainly see how I feel when I sit with it because this was such a perfect ending. I don't know if I necessarily want to go and do other things that may not be as good as a way to finish it off, if you know what I mean. I'm just I'm just so happy with how this has ended. So I'll think about it. We'll see. But I, I'd, I'd say probably not. Uh, but uh, yeah, I, I, this was just so good. This was so good. I kind of want to just leave it there, you know. Thank you very much for watching, though. I hope you've enjoyed. It's been an absolute ple pleasure to play it. Hope it's been a pleasure to watch it. If you have enjoyed, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around. Share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And if you really like what you've seen here, there is a Patreon link in the description. Anything you could afford to send my way would be hugely helpful with the ongoing running of the channel, the buying of games, all that jazz. I would massively appreciate any support in that regard. And uh, yeah, with that, I will see you somewhere else for something new. Thanks for watching. See you then.